What's up, guys? It's your boy, Sully, and I'm back again. All right. Now, today is like a holiday. It's like my birthday. It's like Christmas. You know, uh, it was the release of Yeezy Season 3. And not only that, but more importantly, the album. So we don't yet have an iTunes version of the album, but we were able to hear it streamed over our title while watching his um, fashion line. And I was blown away from the first track. Uh, Ultralight Beams was really good. Sounded more like really like gospel music, but of course with Kanye's twist to it. Um, do I think it's his best work? No, I don't. I think he definitely got some better works out there as in projects as in albums. Do I think it's his worst? No. Uh from the first listen, it definitely sounded better to um better than uh Yeezus to me. Yeezus to me was a good album, so I put that in context, but I think this one definitely sounded better than that. Uh, 808s is my favorite album from him and then My Beautiful Dark Twisted Fantasy. Was it on those levels? I don't know yet. I would have to wait for an iTunes version so I get a couple listens in and then I would update you on that. But from first glance, I personally, I don't think so. But it sounds like music that I can listen to for years to come. All right. Now we're going to get into clothing for a second, but let me just talk about two items in the video shown. The airport sweater, APC Kanye, and the putty jeans, two of the, my favorite items in my whole entire closet. So much so that I have two pairs of the putty jeans, that's one, and I was going to uh, uh, double up on the uh, airport sweater, but my dumb self, I missed the opportunity, and now I just can't. I would have paid crazy amount of money for the... um the beige airport sweater but nowadays it's not even safe for me to do that because people are selling the fakes and all sorts of nonsense so i'm not going to do that i'm just going to stick it out with the one i have and since i have two pairs of the uh the putty jeans i guess i'm good i don't really care for the stone wash i pers i don't like to cut on those okay now I'll jump back into yeezy season three now i'm gonna get those 1050 duck boots I'm personally going to get that. I'm going to try my best to get those. I will only get them through an authorized retailer like I usually do. There is no way, absolutely no way I'm buying them from a reseller for an absurd amount of money. And I wouldn't even buy them from a reseller um, for retail value because, as I said, nowadays you don't know what's authentic and what's not. So I'm going to try my best to get those so I can view those on the channel. Was there any clothes that stuck out to me in particular? No, but like Yeezy season two, Kanye West did a great job with picking out the colors for his models to wear. I think that more than cut to me is what makes those um, Yeezy season stuff stand out is the colors of those items. Um, the cut, I really don't like things that is extremely oversized. It looked a little bit uh, slimmer than... Yeezy season two, but I, I, we're going to have to wait to see more detailed pictures before we could really determine that. Them uh, duck boots, the new ones, the 1050s, you know, I hope those are the same normal price that the other one was because I'll pay something like, okay, if he uh, retails for 600, I'll pay that no problem. I wouldn't even think twice about that. Like, I may even double up on those pairs, but we got to see for quality because. I'm not a person, the only Adidas thing that I own, Ultra Boost, because they're great. I own two pairs of those. But we're going to have to see the quality, and we're going to have to put that in proper context. Will I get uh, the Yeezy Boost? I don't know if I could, but uh, to be honest with you, uh, I'm real tired of ch attempting to get these things. And then they either sell out, websites crash, or you got to jump through a hoop. I'm the type of person where you put it out. You have enough for everybody or you just put the price so damn high that not a lot of people could afford it, you know, so then I can get my pair. But Kanye did a fantastic job with the album, did a fantastic job with the show. And once again, this just shows me that you're making steps as a uh, taking great leaps and bounds as a designer and making uh, greater steps as a designer. It, to, it was an improvement. Over season two, I respect it. You worked hard. Put the damn album on iTunes so I can listen to it, please. And, you know, that's really it. But you guys tell me what you think. Did you like the album? Did you not like it? And if you say you didn't like it or you did like it, please state why. Just don't put in the comment 
I hated it or I loved it because that doesn't really say anything. You know, that's a non-statement. So tell me what was the reason exactly why you liked it or why you disliked it. And also tell me what is your favorite album from uh, Kanye West and what is your favorite clothing um, collaboration that he's ever done or from his own uh, Adidas line. It's been your boy, Sully. St. Laurent versus Paul Mon. Next video. And I'm out. Peace. Have a great day.